Hello, everybody, and welcome to the tavern. My name's Jay. Back with some more uh, Buck Rogers here. So there, uh, there is like this right here. Quick save, quick load, which actually does help. And I, I think I gotta proceed more to the left here. Is this to the left? No, it's to the right. Only the dead are door in this room. Okay, this is nothing. Alright, so nobody did anything here, so just kill, murder. I said murder. Uh, I need to get Oak out of there. Oh, not... Nope. Okay. So, move. And now you can target your... Uh, there you go. I need you murdered. Okay. Uh. Murder. Murder. Thank you. Kaji. Murder. Thank you. I mean, they're dying, not. It is what it is. There we go. Okay, so one is blinded, one I don't care about. Uh, can I actually target you? There we go. That is. Okay, so this room was uh, not worth it to come into. Alright. Uh, Kiwi guessed that. Who is, I think, one of you were missing a smart suit yes or no i should say all right uh view items okay uh there we go you should have there we go so everybody has a good amount of ac This is good enough. Okay, so the waiting room is full, full of the dead. Medical officer. Oh. Ah, oh, damn. some grenades um who is two explosive grenades my grenade experts over here okay all right so there's nothing in there oh i gotta go up now all right more terrain or terrains How do you take control of two? How many people do I have? I have four. There's probably one on each side. One, two, yep. There goes a leader there, a warrior. All right. Who's blinded? Usagi's blinded. All right, you're dying. Brian. Kiwi, go for this guy down here. Oh, just try to be useful. Who else is blinded? Everybody. Okay, so it's hard to see for everybody. Okay, cool. 
Dan is blinded. There we go. You attack the guy over here. Okay, this is gonna be hard because everybody's blinded, so like one, he has like I don't know what his AC actually is, but he has like a good amount of AC. Okay. Uh okay. Dan is the only one that needs to be fully healed. So everything else we're done with there now. Don't have to worry about it. We got plenty of money. Uh, let's see. Authorized personnel only. You burst in among a squad of terrines. In the background, you can see a ram technician working on a missile's control panel. Okay, so this is going to be... Okay, uh... Essentially, it's like, what? Seven enemies, so, like, two... Out of sight, out of sight, out of sight. Because he can't see beyond this door here to shoot. So, best bet is... Where's Kiwi at? Kiwi's up here. Kiwi could throw a grenade back here. If he has it. Okay. Tactics is... I need you to, like, act like switch out items. You have a cutlass. Okay. Okay. So... Target. All right. Okay, so I can only hit a few meters in front of me. Ooh, that was a good hit. Uh. Okay. Oh, you need to actually like, move out of sight. I need this guy to be dead. That's a dazzle grenade that missed. Okay. Alright, so Kiwi can't move anywhere, so I can actually change out my items now. Probably to a cutlass, if I'm gonna be honest, but I think the laser pistol is gonna be great. Alright, so me and I think Elk there are blinded. Alright. Okay, uh, I need you to like, I, I need one, okay. So, knockout, got it. I need you to move up there now. Take this guy out. There is something else to like be weary about, and that's if uh so there's like dying unconscious, much like in DD, dying unconscious and one fatal one which is dead, which I never want to see at all. I, I never want to see dead. Because that essentially means I have to make a new character, which I don't want to do. Alright. Essentially, we're done here. With one hand, the detective should begin firing at you. He is still modifying the controls with the other. If you shoot at him, you may damage the controls, which operates the base's missile. Uh... I don't want to shoot, charge, I take damage, take cover. Hmm. 
No, we'll try that. Okay. 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 Dive on grenade. Okay. Who will dive on the grenade? Someone who has a lot of health. Kaji here. 13 points of damage. Awesome. You are given a small, small reward. Okay, cool. A small reward. What is this? A thousand credits. That's it. Okay, cool. We're on uh, Salvation 3 now. A Neo Officer greets you. I am Carlton Timbarian. To a... Not Timbarian. Terubian. Welcome to Salvation 3. When you are ready, when you are ready, come see me at headquarters for your first assignment. All right. So we can go up here to mingle. Probably nothing to mingle about. Mingle. Okay. Okay, let's talk in here. Uh, medical. Do I need? Do I need medical? My wounds were attended to, so I don't need medical. All right, and down here, I don't think I have access to. Up here, I can get uh, an assortment of guns. All right, so I have to buy some of these things. Okay, so poison antidote. I can buy the needle gun for you. I can sell some of these things. Sell for five credits, really? Oh, you know what? Another thing is uh, I can, again, Whatever I don't need, I can sell. Uh, keep that. Okay. So, we're done here. So, I can get the rocket pistol. Heat gun. He can make a different noise. I'll give you the heat gun. And I'll give... Kaji can stay with the... Okay. Okay. Do that. The heat pistol. The, the laser pistol. Yeah, because if I look at the, uh, skills, tactics, leaderships, zero gravity maneuvering, demolition, climbing, and you'll go with the needle gun. And then I think Kaji here should be go with the laser pistol. Yeah, go with the laser pistol. All right. Uh, who else did I give up? Gun to. I gave myself the heat gun. Alright. And I think we'll be good here. Actually, uh. Have you with nine. Nine poisons. Poison antidotes. Okay. 
So now we're gonna come over here. Take a take a tug out and explore the debris and the earth's in the earth's near orbit. If you find something unusual, investigate. Now I would turn now I would turn you over to our training staff. Okay. Congratulations, Dan is now a level three jock. Uh repair another thing there we'll go with climbing and a little bit of zero gravity okay level three warrior so boom another one to there deception climbing and uh I guess another perception. Uh, let's see. Boom. Demolition. I wonder when I could get like another one of those. Okay, level three medic. So when two more points in there, so one into first aid. And what's the library search? Okay, you are rocket repair, so boom, boom. Uh, let's do Brian would be our fast talker because why not? And now I'm at level three road bypass security, two points into that programming, and then another point into stealth. Okay, so should be good there. And now it should take me, it shouldn't take me all the way back. I have to go all the way back and then I'm going to be starting the mission over. Uh, let, me, let me just quick save this for now. Because then if I quick load it, it's going to quick load me here. All right, launch. As you prepare for your tug, as you, as you as you prepare your tug, Tarabian calls. Good luck on your first mission for Neo. The engines roar as you shoot as you shoot down the launch launching bay. You begin your search of the space debris that orbits Earth. After a few days, you locate something unusual. Yeah, I found a derelict spaceship drifting amongst debris. It has no marking to identify it and no noticeable external damage. You dock it into the ship. Okay. <clears throat> Signs of fierce combat are apparent. Dark spears float past and smear against the sh stained walls. Okay. A body rises, translucent in the ray, in the red, in the red light. Glowing globules spiral away from the figure's flailing arm. It screams and passes through the left wall. Silence descends again. Only to be punctured by the rumble of ship's weapon firing. What's in here? The eyes rivet on a floating body wrapped in a stained coat and missing an arm. Near the corpse is a recorder and a holographic projector. Bits of tape float around the room. Yes. Scott, emergency shutdown now. Where are you? Oh no, power uh, fluctuation. Disruption of containment fields. We will be on schedule for deployment after Earth's sterilization. Projector coming online. Wait, so quickly? The gleaming eyes. No, get back. Ah! This is gonna happen for like a while. This one is dated earlier. The ECG cans are, lo are lo loaded for Earth. They will molt on a planet. This is Dr. Williams, and my stigma, and my stigma code is a string of numbers follow. S Scott is non-functional. 
uh, Scott is not functional. Security is notified. Preparing hologram. Just a precaution. All right. <laughs> Small fan creature splashes towards you. Okay. Um. Small EC Jenny. Okay. Okay. Damn. Okay, cool. That's a uh, one creature down. That's another one down. I think they have a chance to poison too. Failed zero G. Failed zero zero G. Okay. Uh, dizzy, dizzy. Okay. <laughs> That's what I wanted. That's why I gave her the needle gun. Okay. Okay, I need uh everything here to die. There we go. There were no spoils. Okay, so it, it, for this entire section, there's not going to be any spoils. Special bus arrive. When in tones, you have broken isolation orders. Commission is required. No. Ah, shit. Uh, I need out of range. Fuck. I gotta stop pressing that button. Okay. I gotta actually get into range. Okay. 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 Um. Ryan, I need you to. Oh, that's what happened. Okay, so what what's happening right now is those who failed zero G can't move nearly as much. Oh, that's actually terrible. Okay, yeah, those who failed zero G actually. So what what that actually means in terms of like failing zero G is uh, you're easier to hit. Your movement is limited. You're easier to hit. Terror controls are, de are deactivated. Your ship is not on the scanners. Terminate. Terminate. Ah, shit. More robots. Okay. Uh... So, in other words, right now, I can't do much. You're fucking me. Brian is useless. <laughs> okay.
I need to get um I need to get like a different set of guns. Shit. Okay. Okay. Uh This is gonna be fucking asinine. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. I'm glad I have these two who act like succeeded zero G. And then I can't do anything with this because he becomes useless. Kiwi is just useless at close range. I mean, long range. Okay. Okay. You're pretty much done. Okay, attacks of three. Attack of six. Oh, okay, so so the attack of six is like how many times they can attack. Oh, I, I can just easily get close up in your face right now. There we go. Destroyed is just a robot being destroyed because they, they can't die. Nothing there. Okay. Uh, stay. I want to. I want to finish exploring this level first. There is an up and a down. Obviously, I just need to explore this area first. Not need, but want. The ship's oasis, the hydroponic garden, seems peaceful. The sound and smells of this room begins to relax you. Dan remembers a quiet evening with an old girlfriend. Dan remembers the quiet nights and feels a, feels again the pleasant embrace. Brian awakes from peaceful contemplation in time to see Dan imprisoned in the vines of an unknown plant. Small thorns penetrate the armor. The vines pulse, pulse in time to Dan's heartbeat. Attack. Nearby, a plant says stage 4 ECG uses sonic and scent cues to lure victims, similar to Earth Pitcher Plant. Terminate. <sighs> bitch. Terminate. This is a bitch. Alright. You know what? It, it, at least they're in my face. I don't have to, like, actually worry about anything. Oh, that's right, you're useless. <laughs> okay. Ah, no, elk, you can't die. You're useless. Okay. Okay. Okay, I need... Okay, what's it gonna matter? I still needed him to move. Okay. So, like, right now, Elk is, like, completely dying. Okay, Kaji gets a splitting headache. Um... Is there anything I can do? 
Briar has all the uh, antidotes. I don't, okay. I don't know what else I can do here. Uh, Kadi suddenly kills over. What is in here? It's probably a robot attack or something. This room contains the air sampling equipment for the ship. Oh, okay, so nothing. Is there anything else? Okay, there's nothing else I can actually go up or down. Elk's leg itches for a moment. Okay, I'm actually gonna go down. You're on deck one. Engineering deck and... Okay, so slowly squirting rash. I might have to go up to, uh... No. Not yet. Um... Okay, so I'm gonna have to go up to deck two, or deck three, I should say. Or, what's in here? Nothing of immediate use. Alright, so there's nothing there. What's this? Okay, so I gotta go up to, uh, deck three. Okay, I'm actually going to save it here and then save it here. I did save, right? Newest team, okay, yeah. Okay, so with that said, uh, we're done here. So right now, I ha I don't have access to much of anything. I'm still on like a predestined. Uh, I'm on like a linear path for now. Nothing's really set in stone yet, but it's a path for now. I think this. So this game is either short or long, depending on what you do. For now, I, I'm going to like leave it here because we just started exploring uh, this ship, which would be like the second part of uh, it's still technically it's still considered like part of the intro. The first one is trying to like, get you caught up with the game. After this, we have free reign to, to like sort of explore. But uh, with that said, I hope you enjoy this as much as I do, because to me this is just D&D &D in space with different mechanics. And I actually like how this game works. I gotta actually like, find certain areas, because uh, right now it should be uh, one of my people is probably like unconscious or something. Yeah, like Kadi Kad is unconscious and that's only because of uh, what's going on with the area. And soon, Elk is going to be unconscious. Because, uh, there's something going on in this area. Obviously. But with that said, thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, a comment. Tell me if this was, like, one of your childhood games. Or if you played this game or heard of this game. I don't think many people do. Or I don't think many people did. And I actually had this on the Sega Genesis and I played it pretty much to like the nauseam of my brother who would uh, hate the, hate me playing this game. But with that said, uh, the tavern is now closed. I shall see you all later.